This month, you've heard us talk a lot about body cameras and how they can hold police accountable. Well, this morning, we're looking at a different kind of camera program focused on crime. It's called Cameras for Good, and it encourages neighborhoods to set up surveillance. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan joins us with the details on how this works. Charlie, we are already used to the idea of things like traffic cameras potentially keeping eyes on what we're doing as we drive around. This takes it even another step. Right, this is called a smart watch program, Taylor, and the whole idea here is that if people know that there's cameras watching them when they're out and about in neighborhoods, well, then they won't commit crime. So the police department, like the one here behind me, has partnered with other organizations to really get this program, Cameras for Good, off, up, and running. And over the last two years or so, they've installed about 50 cameras in a dozen different Kansas City, Missouri neighborhoods, like the ones you're seeing here on your screen right now. And in that time period, some neighborhood association presidents tell me that they have seen those cameras capture things like illegal dumping, assaults, prostitution, anything along those lines. One of those neighborhood presidents tells me he wants to get more cameras in his neighborhood. I'm all for it because if you can make the neighborhood that you live in safer, or even the uh, appearance of it being safer because we can put 21st century technology into play, it makes, it's a game changer. A game changer indeed. The hiccup here is Cameras for Good did not receive 20 in, uh, funding in 2020 to buy new cameras. Of course, the organization, though, will still help guide neighborhoods if they want to make their own investment in those cameras. They give them an advice on how to get all that, all everything set up. It's the organization Connecting for Good, which is operating Cameras for Good. Reporting live in Kansas City, Missouri, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.